Hello everyone. Welcome to the next lecture on the IIT Jam 2025. Today, this is a part two on the memory-based question of the mathematical statistics. Myself, Dr. Harish Kar. You can follow my YouTube channel where you can find the playlist of the IIT Jam solution. In this playlist, you can see the various lecture related to the IIT Jam solutions, either in the terms of the memory-based or in the terms of the complete. solutions you must watch about this playlist and learn the many shortcut tricks in this lecture i will explain you the two different question one is related to the volume and second is related to the radius of the convergence make sure student these are the memory based questions so the statement i had received from the students i have put up in this video if there is some statements are wrong or some statements are missing Uh, you can provide me the correct statement in the comment box i will upload the next solution uh, based according to your uh, statements if you are new to my youtube video you can scan and join my whatsapp group if you are interested i hope you can like and comment on this video as well now if you read the statement very carefully you have to targets to find the volume of the region as i mentioned you this is a memory based questions i will consider the two different cases the case one is because i i never know what is the exact statement so firstly i assume that this statement is not given to you fine then how you can find the volume of the region second i will tell you the again the solution also if this case is given to you so let's say firstly i can assume this condition is not given how you can find the volume divided by pi you all knows volume you can write as a dx dy into dz and then you can take in the value of the y, x from this case is a minus 1 minus y square or minus z square and it is 1 plus and so on similarly you can take the value of the y and then z but if you try to solve this problem it will take you the 3 minutes at least but in the examination you have a maximum of 1 minute to solve the problem that means this approach is definitely not successful while in the examinations then how you can solve the problem so for that if you already watch my this shortcut tricks lecture have you watch my this lecture volume of the solid then you can get the answer of this problem in a couple of second what is the couple of the second is if you remember what is this equation x square over a square y square over b square and z square over c square is 1 do you know what is the equation name is this is ellipsoid and once is ellipsoid what is the volume of the ellipsoid 4 over 3 pi a b c and if you if you compare them what is my a a is my 1 b is my 1 c is my 2 so the volume will be if you substitute them answer is 8 pi over 3 and then you can easily calculate v upon pi fine this is the first case now if this mod of z is less than 1 given to you then definitely you are unable to apply this formula why because this is my restriction given to you fine and then again how you can solve this problem in a couple of second so again the same shortcut tricks i had used in this lecture what i told you whenever you will see in any of the statement is x square plus y square you always convert into the polar coordinates fine and once you convert into the polar coordinate your dx into dy will be r dr into d theta so your volume that is dx dy into dz i can substitute the value of dx into dy so that is my r dr d theta into dz fine then this equation becomes this value is my r square plus z square by 4 is less than equal to 1 now you can take the limits firstly i can take the limit of the theta only fine now this is the independent of theta so if you integrate them it is my 2 pi double integration r dr into dz fine now if you look about this curve again again this equation is called as a ellipse fine so can you draw the ellipse you can see z is my 2 x r is my 1 so this is the equation of the ellipse fine this is just look like say x and y but you have the restriction of this is my 
this is my 1. So you have the restriction of z is equal to 1, z is equal to minus 1. So which one is the por common portion is? Your target is to find this green color portion. Fine. Now clearly say because of the curve is symmetric. So what you can do? I can write this equation is 4 times. 4 times of. 4 times of this only. So that means if you taken as a 4 times 8 pi double integration r dr dz. Clear? Now you can take the limits of the r. You can find the limits of the r from this case in the first quadrant 1 minus z square by 4 and the value of the z is 0 to 1 because this is the equation of z is equal to 1. That's over. Now you can integrate them. It's a 8 pi. It's a r square by 2. It's a 1 over 2 r square. So that will be z square by 4 into dz. So 2 and 8 pi cancel. Integration of this will be z minus z cube over 12 from 0 to 1. So what is the answer of this? When you substitute 1, it's a 11 over 4. Sorry, 11 over 12. Fine. So it will be 3. So the answer is 11 pi divided by 3 is the right answer. Now your target is to find the v over pi. 11 over 3 is my correct answer of this problem. If this is the given condition of the problem. So you can see that by changing into the polar coordinates and you must watch about my this lecture volume of the solid. If you already watch them, I hope you can get your right answer in a couple of seconds. But if you miss to watch, I suggested you must watch about this lecture today and you will get the right answer in a couple of props, couple of time. Okay, look at the second problem. Again, this is a memory based question which is related to the radius of convergence. And if you watch already my radius of the convergence lecture, which is just uploaded two months back or from this date and you can get again the answer in a very simple manner. What is the radius of convergence? As I told you, it is 1 over limit an plus 1 over an as n approaches infinity or either you can use this formula. Otherwise, you can use limit n approaches infinity an raised to power 1 over n. And what is the an? You can compare the series with the given power 1. So what is the an is? n factorial over n raised to power n. Fine. So clearly say what is the n factorial raised to power 1 over n. If you take a raised to power n, so that limit is fine. But how you can find the limit of the n factorial? That is not an easy for you or even for us. So that's why I am using this formula. So can you find the a n plus 1 over a n? What is the a n plus 1? n plus 1 factorial divided by n plus 1 into n plus 1 multiply by n raised to power n over n factorial. So if you take on the n plus 1 factorial and n plus 1, it will be n plus 1. I can break into n and n plus 1 into n raised to power n. So clearly say 1 plus n will be cancelled. So I can write this part is power n will be the common. I can divide the numerator and denominator by n. So now if you take the limit as n approaches infinity. So can you find the limit of this? It is 1 over e. So what is the right answer of this? If you substitute here. So your radius of convergence is my 1 over 1 by e. E is my right answer of this problem. Fine. So you can see you need to do just couple of seconds. I again I need I think a maximum of the 15 second or maximum of the 20 second are needed to get the limit of the 1 by e. So again I suggested you you must watch about my this radius of the convergence lecture. And let me know in the comment box whether the statement of the both the questions are correct or not. If it is not correct, then give me the correct statement in the comment box. I will upload the next video based on your statements. Otherwise, if you remember more questions on the IIT JM mathematics or mathematical statistics, send me in the comment box. I will upload the, again the solutions on that solutions. I hope you can like and comment on this video and share this video with your friends. 
I will come up with the next video very soon. Till then, you can like and share this video with your friends. And don't forget to comment and subscribe my YouTube channel. Happy learning students. Best of luck.